All right, so for the very first time in Call of Duty Mobile history, they've actually implemented a seasonal challenge skin that I want to get. And like I said, this is the very first time they've ever done it. For the most part, their seasonal challenge skins are throwaways, but just wait until you see this one. So if you go to event, seasonal, and rifle steamroller, you will see the final unlock for these sets of challenges is the KN44 Golden Talon. Free epic skin, and this thing actually looks really clean. For sure, this would be something I thought I'd be seeing in a crate, but... I guess they were feeling generous and decided to give this one away here for free and the challenges are pretty simple as well so we are just about done unlocking this skin but i figured before we go ahead and get some gameplay with it i would actually show you guys how to go about unlocking this for those of you who don't know because one of the challenges is actually kind of just i don't know complicated doesn't really tell you how to do it so so for the first one it's pretty straightforward kill 20 enemies with an assault rifle that one you could probably knock out in one match of multiplayer moving forward though this is the complicated one kill 30 enemies with any assault rifle fitted with recommended attachments or equipment system recommendation 2 ads and control so that one honestly i'm still not sure about but what i personally did was went to the bk57 Go to gunsmith and then you'll see this little yellow light bulb icon you click that and it'll bring up the recommended attachment screen and i went with ads and control just to be safe because i had went with i think fast ads to begin with and it wasn't actually counting it so personally i did the bk57 but the way you actually go about doing these challenges is like i said going to any of the assault rifles and clicking that yellow light bulb and picking one of the system recommendations moving forward though after that you will have kill 30 enemies with any assault rifle equipped with any stock and four other attachments so make sure you have five attachments with one of them being a stock next one pretty much the same thing except instead of a stock an optic and then you have another one with the same challenges but instead of an optic it's going to be an under barrel so just basically any grip and then it moves forward to asval challenges so this one's going to be kill 30 enemies with any version of the valve so you don't need any attachments unlocked you just need to have the weapon itself and then the lastly it's actually going to be kill 30 enemies with that as val equipped with any five attachments so once you have five attachments unlocked for it put them on there hop into some matches and once you get 30 kills you will unlock the kn44 and that's currently where i'm at right now you guys can see i've got 25 of the 30 so we've got five more kills to go until we have this thing unlocked so i figured we just go ahead and hop into a free-for-all slay out some enemies here on camera with you guys and then uh, unlock the skin so it should be fairly simple we got high rise here for a matchup free for all is 20 kills to win we only need five should be able to do this pretty easily let's get it i think the majority of our lobby is just bots as well so easy peasy also today for the very first time i equipped 120 fps on my ipad and oh my god this game feels incredible it honestly feels like a, like a PC game to me. So one of my sentry guns getting kills, I figured we'd go ahead and show you guys this. If you go to settings and go to audio and graphics, move your graphic quality down to medium or low and see if you have ultra MP only unlocked. Because if you do, that means your device can actually run the game at 120 FPS. And like I said, man, it's so different than like the standard 60 or maybe even whatever max is like 90. We got just a couple more kills here until we win the game. So we should be able to close this out strong. ASVAL is also a really fun weapon to use. If you guys want to see me do more gameplay on it, I'm totally down for it. I've been loving this weapon. And I'll do it. And there we go. We just unlocked the new KN. All right, so this is the build that we decided to go with for the KN44. And it looks a little bit weird, but let me explain myself. We went with the MIP light muzzle brake because it actually significantly helps horizontal recoil by 18%, which is a ridiculous amount. But it does lower mobility quite a bit, so we use the no stock to basically combat that. But with those two attachments combined, my vertical recoil isn't great, so we went with the operator foregrip just to get all that up. And then we did the OWC tactical laser since that's like a standard mobility attachment, helpful on pretty much everything without really having a downside. And we did stippled grip tape to also get that mobility up, as well as that sprint to fire delay, which is a huge 15% bonus. So overall, this is like a pretty well balanced build with also increased mobility and horizontal recoil controls. So I'm pretty happy with it. We'll see how it performs here in some ranked games, and I'll see you guys once we find a match. All right, we got Summit TDM. This shouldn't be too bad off the start. Oh my God, I'm just gonna peek that and try to get out of here i'm getting hanged by those gas grenades hopefully our teammates get out of the way i don't know since it is tdm i'm gonna try to get away with my life in as many situations as i can still got more opponents all over us spawns just flipped 
Yeah, the accuracy on this thing is actually kind of nutty. We got one more. I got footsteps down low. It's not a bad build at all. Should still be spawned up here. Dude, what is up with everybody and using thermites nowadays? Oh my god. Literally everybody is using thermites, I swear. This guy's actually firing back. Drop that down, just for a second. Okay, now that I'm actually, like, regened here. Challenge that, and there's a third player. I'm not sure where he went, but we'll pop the UAV. I hate challenging fights right there. Got our Annihilator ready. Here more footsteps. Nice. They still spawn up over here? Dude, the Annihilator on 120 FPS feels nutty. It feels so smooth. Is this guy hanging out here? I saw him on the radar. Another one. This guy's pushing through green. We should be on a flank on them now. And spawns are flipping as well. That guy must have heard me. Oh. That guy shot a rocket launcher at me. What a psycho. Ouch. Got another annihilator. We'll go ahead and pop this. Why not? 26 and a TDM. Nice. Okay, moving on to standoff TDM. All right, we're going to flick the back alleyway here off the start. I don't hear any footsteps in here. Right, I saw we got a guy in the courtyard. I hear him pre firing. Okay, he should be reloading now. <laughs> that was great timing. Also, sounds like we got a player above us. Could possibly just jump down. Ah, uh, it's pain. Very pain now. I gotta just lay here prone for a second, regen HP. Let me go back up top here real fast. I'll take that double. Oh my god. Dude, did you see that sniper actually like come straight for my face? Oh, uh, there's a guy up top. That's gotta be the Arctic guy, right? Oh, I'm dead. Ouch. I hate gas grenades. Enemy contact. I hate thermites and gas grenades. Those are like the two worst things in the world for me. Does this guy know I'm here? Okay, I guess he didn't. He's throwing me off so much. Honestly, I need to get like a little bit more mid-range type fights going on right now. For the most part, we're taking really good like SMG fights. But this isn't it here for the KN. I'm gonna go back up top here. We got a couple more coming in. All right, let's whip out the annihilator. Oh my god, pain. On the fight though. It actually worked out really well. Oh, don't get sniped, don't get sniped, don't get sniped. So there's another one. Oh, nice. And then we got the shock RC to drop. Huge set of kills right there, man. Just one away from closing this out. And that'll do it. 24 there to secure the win. Nice. All right, everyone, that is where we're going to go ahead and call it here for today's video, though. Thank you all so much for tuning in here to today's mobile channel upload. We will have another upload over on the Plays channel later today. And for those of you who aren't subscribed, it's my PC content channel where I do like daily to even double uploads. So link will be in the description as always. But guys, that's going to go ahead and do it here for myself. Thank you all so much for watching, and I'll catch you all in the next one.